The man who says he filmed an open beer bottle in a Mobile Sheriff's deputy car is speaking about what he saw. In a News 5 exclusive interview, Dana Winter met up with him earlier today. She joins us live in the studio with the de details on the investigation. Dana. Philip Little tells News 5 he and his family were walking out of Lowe's at Tillman Corner when his son spotted what he says looked like a beer bottle in the front of a Mobile County Sheriff's deputy car. It was literally open. It was an open container. Philip Little says he did not believe his son at first when he told Philip he saw an open beer bottle in a Mobile County Sheriff's deputy car as the family was leaving a hardware store. The officer was parked beside us when we come out and my son looked over and seen the beer bottle. He's like, hey PJ, there's a beer in the car. I was like, a beer? Nah, whatever. Little says Cheers. once he looked himself, he was shocked. You looky looky. Open beer. He didn't pick it up off the ground or nothing. There wasn't no dirt on it. It was an open container. Little says this is an issue of public safety. Here's this guy that's a cop that can go around drinking and driving and possibly hurting a child or somebody drinking and driving. He tells News 5 he hopes the sheriff's office takes action towards the deputy. I'm not saying I want to see him lose his job, but I want to see a report showing that he has, you know, been suspended with no pay. We reached out to MCSO, who gave us this statement. On March 17, 2018, a video was sent to our office by WKRG-TV of a Mobile County Sheriff's Office patrol vehicle with what appears to be a beer in the console of the car. The video was taken by someone in the parking lot of a local hardware store. The Mobile County Sheriff's Office has opened an internal investigation on the deputy as well as the video provided by several other local stations. MCSO has reached out to the person who took video and requested it be forwarded to us. However, as of this afternoon, our office has not received a copy. The investigation is ongoing. Little told us earlier tonight a detective was on the way to his house. We're, of course, keeping you up to date with the latest developments in this story on our website, WKRG.com. Reporting live in studio, Dana Winter, News 5.